The recipient of the Engineering Medal for Entrepreneurship is Dr. Milos Popovich. My name is Milos Popovich. I'm the Institute Director of the Kite Research Institute. It's a research arm of the Toronto Reputation Institute, which is the hospital within the University Health Network hospital system. I'm especially in research which is uh, pertinent to designing neuroprosthetic systems. These are the devices that interface central and peripheral nervous system of patients. I have successfully created a technology for restoring the hand function. From the technology point of view, my main contribution is to figure out that you can actually design electrical stimulation protocols that will enable somebody who's paralyzed to move the arm in the same way as somebody who's healthy, like you and I. The second innovation was to find the type of pulses that when you provide them to the people, that they're not painful, so that people feel comfortable about them. And the third innovation was help to package all this into the therapeutic treatment that will help somebody reprogram the brain. The technology is very simple to deliver to the patients, and there's no side effects. When you deliver the therapy to them, they really have profound change in functions. Some of our patients were 38 years after a stroke. So imagine somebody who was 38 years like that, and then you work with this patient for a couple of weeks and then you can go pick up the objects. That's very exciting. Two of my friends who are engineers and I, we started up the company in somewhere in 2008, called it MindTech. Since then, you know, company had a couple of evolutions and now the product is Canada, it's in the United States. It's FDA approved and Health Canada approved and we are hoping it's going to be approved by early next year for Europe, so we are now trying to scale it up and deliver it worldwide. Crania is the center which spun off from all this effort I have done in uh, neuromodulation field with MindTech. The focus of Crania is to work on technologies which will end up in patients within five years. I think Crania is going to change the landscape in this space because people who want to improve their technology, improve the design, or test the design. They can do it all here in Toronto. The key to my successful career is I have no problem failing. I think persistence in purpose and desire to get the things done, for, in my case, for patients, and not giving up on that was very important. The career in engineering is, um, for me, it was a great choice because that's one of the few fields, in my opinion, that you can really change the universe. Our species is heavily submerged in the technology, and this technology is accelerating at a very high rate. And the people who bring this to us are engineers. So I'm very proud to be part of that community which is changing the way how we live and who we are. For his work to commercialize a life-changing electrical stimulation therapy for restoring upper limb function in stroke and spinal cord patients, engineer Milos Popovich is being recognized with the Engineering Medal in the Entrepreneurship category.